Are we ready? Yep. All right, take off. At USF, education isn't just confined to the classroom. We will try our best. Now, it's sky high. I see us working with all kinds of departments, architecture, engineering, environmental studies. All with drones, complete with mounted cameras. The Bulls have added a fleet for the fall semester, part of a brand new overhaul of library services. How much fun is it flying this around campus? It, well, I haven't done a whole lot of it, but what I have done is, is both fun and a little bit scary. Mary Ellen Allen is the pilot today, one of a few on campus who know how to operate these machines. The drones weigh about five pounds, have four spinning propellers, and endless possibilities for young, creative minds. We understand that libraries are doing all kinds of different things to collect information and organize it and help students access it. I asked if I could fly the drone and the answer was no. I'm not a USF student. I haven't done the training course and I don't have a faculty supervisor taking care of it for me. They're $1,500 a piece, so if you break it, you buy it. You can't just take it out of class for no reason. It's going to take some thinking, and I think you're going to have to have a pretty good justification and outline exactly why you need it and what you're going to do with it. The faculty says USF is one of the only universities they know of offering these flying learning tools in hopes that their students can reach new heights. There's just all kinds of, I think, interesting uses that uh, this kind of technology will bring to our students. On campus, I'm Bobby Lewis, 10 News.